Hey everybody, welcome to Defense Vault. South Korea's KF-21 fighter jet has successfully completed its missile and cannon firing tests. This young Korean hawk is gearing up for operational deployment and poses a serious challenge to the world's top fighter jets. South Korea's KF-21 Bora Mei fighter program has taken a major step toward operational readiness with the sixth prototype successfully completing a series of critical tests. Program officials have confirmed that the advanced 4.5 generation jet has safely carried out high-risk trials, including air-to-air -air cannon firing and weapon separation tests. Developed by Korea Aerospace Industries KAI, the project is on track to complete the first phase of its development by early next year. The development of this fighter jet is progressing at a rapid pace, with Phase 2 upgrades set to begin immediately after the completion of Phase 1. These advancements are helping solidify South Korea's position as a leading power in the global defense and aerospace industry. Chom Young Su, the chief test pilot at KAI, highlighted the rapid pace of testing aimed at improving the flight control systems and ensuring the jet's combat readiness following the latest test campaign. He explained that the recent flight focused on monitoring how the aircraft's condition might change during the firing of the internal gun. The development team confirmed that the flight control system can effectively keep the aircraft stable even during rapid-fire scenarios. Prototype number 6 of the KF-21 fighter jet has played a pivotal role in testing advanced electronic warfare systems. The other aircraft in the six-unit fleet have been designated for specific missions such as high angle of attack recovery and radar integration. The test program is fully modular, with each prototype focused on validating different capabilities to accelerate overall development. KAI has confirmed that the program has so far logged over 1,300 test flights, accounting for nearly 70% of all flights planned for the first phase. Recent milestones include the successful firing of Meteor and IM-2000 air-to-air missiles. These tests were completed successfully even during supersonic flight and with external fuel tanks attached. One of the program engineers at KAI noted that the KF-21 fighter jet has shown consistent progress from initial glide tests to complex combat scenarios. These achievements have kept the program on schedule for operational evaluation by the Republic of Korea Air Force in early next year. Phase 2 upgrades will add precision air-to-ground strike capabilities to the KF-21 further solidifying its role as South Korea's next frontline fighter. Future variants of the aircraft are also expected to feature fully internal weapon bays to enhance stealth performance. The Bora Mei, which means Young Hawk in Korean, is designed to replace South Korea's aging F-4 and F-5 fighters. It is also being positioned as a potential export platform for allied nations. With the first phase nearing completion and the second phase on the horizon, South Korea's ambitious fighter program is rapidly becoming a cornerstone of the nation's defense modernization efforts. What do you think about this technology? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching till the end. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And until the next video, take care and stay safe.